Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert from UnkertEducation.com here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install and set up Prettier on VS Code. But first, if you like videos where I show you how to install and set up software, make sure to subscribe. Okay, with that being said, let's get started. So I have this index.html file open. This is the landing page of UnkertEducation.com with my articles and a bunch of the videos that I've posted on um, YouTube. Now, I can format this with Control-Shift-I, and that'll run the VS Code default formatter, and it formats it pretty nicely, and I can save it, and that looks pretty good. But some people like to use Prettier as their formatter, and a lot of professionals use it as the default formatter, so if you have teammates that are using Prettier, you should be using Prettier too. Luckily, in VS Code, it's very easy to set up. So what I'm gonna do first do is go to my extensions here, and I'm going to search for Prettier. Okay, so I've got this code formatter using Prettier. I can click to install. Okay, now once it's installed, we have to set Prettier as our default uh, formatter. So I'm going to do control comma, and I'm going to search for formatter. And right now we see we don't have a default formatter. If I expand this list though, we have a bunch of different uh, options we can choose okay and what we want to look for is now that we've installed prettier is prettier so we want to select that option the other thing you want to do is click format on save okay so and there's a bunch of different options here you can format it um, in different ways and you can really go in if you search for prettier here you can uh, look at all the, the different things that you can choose with uh, Prettier. Now this depends on your work colleagues, but um, you know, for instance, uh, if I want to go down, um, let's see what we got here. We've got JSS, JSX single quotes, so if you wanted single quotes in your uh, files that use JSX, you could do that. Um, print with, you can change that, so on and so forth. Uh, I'm pretty much going to keep the default. I'll keep the single quote for JSX. It's not going to really affect my HTML file here, but um, now when I go to use the keyboard shortcut Control shift i it's going to format with Prettier. And you'll see it changes to the Prettier format standard, which by default is two spaces here, and um, you notice it, it wraps the anchor tag slightly differently, so on and so forth. And that's pretty much all there is to it to set up Prettier in VS Code. Um, hopefully this video is helpful to you and hopefully it lets you, you know, uh, sync your formatting with your teammates at your workplace. If it was helpful to you, could you please give it a like as that will help the video um, reach more people. Thank you.